Now, I've been having some trouble printing a model that has a rather complex footprint. So the raft itself um, is disconnected and not continuous. And so corners of the raft are peeling up as it's printing, colliding with the print head, and then lifting up more of the raft. And consequently, I've had to cancel the print job. And I'll just show you the evidence of that. Here's one attempt. I don't know if you can see on the edge on how rough that su surface is. I've tried using glue stick halfway through the print job to try and stick it all back down again. Fails. Tried using the brim option. That failed. So I realised the problem is the raft is not continu continuous. So I'll just swivel around to show you. Here's Tinkercad. Now, I've got the model here, and I've just added a big rectangular base to the bottom. This is this part here. Now, there is a gap between the model and the base of about uh, half a millimeter. Now, in the, in the XYZ web program, you can sort of see there's the model, there's the gap and the base and then the raft material supporting that base. So I'll just pan back. So there's the overall model. But you can see now that the raft is nice and continuous, one big solid piece. And I'll just show you the 3D printer. Hopefully this one will work out all right now. So you can see it's laying down that base uh, relatively well. If I come in from the top, you can see the base is printing out nicely. So that's the most that's the most important thing is that that raft or the first few layers go down smoothly. If they don't go down smoothly, chances are your model is not going to print properly. It'll just slowly spiral into total self-destruction. So you've got to have that initial raft printed well. So I've forced the software to give me a nice raft by adding that rectangular base. Otherwise it just refused to, there's no option to say, give me one complete raft. It tries to save material, but actually that ends up complicating, um, uh, making it much more difficult to print out a good model. All right, thank you.